I was always a cross country skier and when I was nine I was training with my Nordic club and there's ski jumps at our Nordic area and I, I saw them jumping and I wanted to try it. So I think my mom thought it would last about two weeks and here I am 15 years later. <laughs> That was a really long jump. What happened? Are you were there? It's something you don't see. I was asked by FIS to, to be a role model here. And at first I wasn't quite sure because I'm an active athlete and it's a week and a half out of my schedule and away from normal training. But it's I'm really glad I decided to do this because it's an amazing experience. I've never been to a Youth Olympic Games and it's it's really important to me to be here supporting the young athletes and, and I've learned a lot about the Olympic spirit and and just what's happening here. Do you want me to are you just taking them to the bottom? Oh yeah. Uh to the truck? Or to the room? I can take them. The kids and the youth who choose Nordic Combined are sort of the, the children that are always jumping off things, are always wanting to fly and always wanting to push the limits of sort of gravity. I don't really think of it as bravery, but I, I guess it is. You have to be pretty calm, especially on a long weekend, because you really have two competitions a day, not one competition a day. So if you're stressed out or nervous, or just really excited, you're, you're going to get a little worn out. So it really teaches you to be calm and take things one step at a time, which, I mean, honestly, those are great life skills to have. Next jumper, Jenny Novak, Germany. How was equipment control? Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, are you ever nervous when you go in to get your equipment checked? No. No? no. Yeah. Okay yeah. For me, as an athlete, just like any other athlete, I dream of being in the Olympics and being at that level. But as a community, Nordic Combined has to put women's Nordic Combined in the Olympics. And I think that's something that we're all striving for and all working towards. But it's really hard to say when it will be in the Olympics. Just have the chance to sit back and watch and talk to these athletes and see how their competition is going is, is really just a gift and something that I haven't ever experienced before. I'm having a great time here, for sure.